Our students represent a broad range of backgrounds, cultures, that come from all over the state, the region, and we welcome them here on the hill. So when I came here to Alabama A&M, our, our tour guide was Mr. Hall. Mr. Hall had that bulldog pride that nothing, no one could, could compare to. He was just so proud and he took us up on the hill and he was like, this is where you want to be, this is where you need to be. And I absolutely fell in love with the campus and the history. It's hard to describe a typical student at A&M uh, because there's so many different kinds of people. There's a lot of non-traditional students like me uh, who go home at night and they have kids and they have families uh, or maybe they have other jobs. Um, but there's also a lot of students who live here on campus and this is all that they do uh, every day. The number one things about coming to A&M is, is the level of personalized attention that you can get as a student is, is so much greater than anywhere else I've visited or been. I was the president of the math club during my senior year, Lambda Sigma Pi. I was a university echo, one of the ambassadors for the university. I was on the traveling team for the uh, academic team for the school, Honda Campus All-Star Challenge, so I got to go to Orlando and other cities and compete in the Scholars Bowl tournament. One thing that I admired specifically about a and was the student-teacher ratio in the classrooms. It really gives you a chance to connect with the teachers that uh, are teaching you the information. If you have problems, you can go to them and they know your name. They, uh, by this time, they know what area you might be struggling in. And they're really able to approach you in a way that you can really learn the material that you want to at a good pace and then uh, be successful. I'm also a co-op on um, the Arsenal with Teledyne Brown Engineering. And I was given that opportunity from one of, a professor. He was not a professor of mine. That's that's the type of, type of relationships the engineering building has. He was not a professor of mine. He was a mechanical engineering professor. But he knew of a co-op that was looking for a technology, technology majors. And he said, well, you know, I have an opportunity. Would you like to come? And I've been there. And I've been there ever since for, for three semesters now. So. One of the things about Alabama A&M is that there is a very diverse and rich history involved. There are a number of things that students can be involved in that will help them grow as people. And we make sure that those experiences are ones that they can have and very deeply be involved in here on the campus. One thing that we expect from our students is a deep commitment to their field. This field takes a lot of work, it takes a lot of effort, it takes a lot of time, but the rewards are great. We have students that come from some of maybe the most rural areas of Alabama to some of the larger cities. But when they come here, there's a common purpose, there's a common thread, and that is to get the knowledge necessary to make them successful on the next level. This is our responsibility to provide this to them and it's their responsibility to come and get it.